Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rosanna. So in this week's video, I have all these clickety clack, clickety clack lip products. I wanted to compare them. I have some high end, I have some drugstore. So that is what we're gonna be doing today. But before we get into that video, I would love, love, love for you to subscribe to my channel. You could ring the bell. It will give you notifications of what I post, which is every Tuesday and every Saturday. So yup, like, make comments, tell your friends, subscribe, help a newbie out. I would so, so appreciate your support. And thank you so, so much for helping me grow this channel. And now without further ado, let's get started. Okie dokies. So I have a couple of products here that I wanted to test out because I just did a video recently on the e.l.f. These are the e.l.f.s. Where are you, Elfie poo? Um, pout clout um, lip pump plumping pens. So I did do a video on that last week. I think like testing out new products. I don't even remember. But then it got me thinking. I have the tart, uh, the original tart maracujas. I have those. I also have a few of the hourglass. And then I also have a few of the NYX. So I figured, why don't we just try them out? Out of curiosity, I'm not saying who's better, who isn't, you know, high-end drugstore. I'm just out of my own curiosity. I'm thinking, let's test them out. So that's what we're going to do. Okie dokies. So just for, I just have a little bit of lip balm on. So I'm going to just tapity tap tap that off. A little lip balm. Of course, my usual, the City Beauty City Lips Plumping Lip Balm in clear. Of course, they're always linked in um, my description box below. It is an affiliate link. So if you shop on there, it does help my channel. But they offer a 15% discount to you guys. I love them. Anywho, it's linked below. So that's all I have on. And I figured I just wanted to do just like a neutral lip liner. Just like a lip liner, this is the um, the um, Elf. These are the their new lip liners, and I think this is in Baddest Beige. Let me see who in the world can see. I want to just show you. It ain't me. I know I'm 56. I know that. But for the love, for the love of the Lord up above, can you freaking see that? I bet you you can't. I don't know. I don't even know if that was in focus, but I'm going to just patty pat pat. And I'm going to go in order of when I purchased them. So we're going to go with the Tarte Maracuja. These are the Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip um, Balms, and they're $24. Just like everybody else when they first came out, I just quickly clacked and like put them on. They're so friggin' soft. So we are not going to make that mistake. So I'm going to just line my lips. Like I said, just a neutral pencil. And you don't really even need a liner, but I figured, why not? Greg, I do your mustache, but whatever. I digress. Mind your business. Why can't I tell the people your secrets? Okay, cool. I'm going to just blend that in a little, little bit. Okay. Now, I purposefully did not um, jot down any like formula, ingredients, oils, this and that. I just want to feel, I just want to feel what feels good on my lips. That's all I'm looking at. Now, I did pick up hibiscus and orchid, but the, they, they came off. So I'm not really sure which is which because it's it's on the bottom over here. So let's see here. I don't friggin' know. I'm going to swatch them for you. So I don't know which is which. Let's just swatch. And I'm going to do just like that much of a click. You see that it's like hardly anything. So... Yeah, this is so pretty. I want to say maybe that this is hibiscus. Look how beautiful that is, right? Hibiscus slash orchid. I'm not sure. Same thing. I'm going to do just two clicks. And there they are right there. They almost look identical, but whatever. Let's just put them on the lips, shall we? I'm going to just tap. Like normally when they first came out, of course, we dug right in. We were like, what the hell? It was so thick. So I'm going to just tap. Just like that. They have a little bit of a scent to them. You know how I feel about scents. I'm not a fan. But as long as I don't like taste them. So this is absolutely beautiful. I'm so bummed. I don't know the color, but it's either hibiscus or orchid. I'm going to come close to you, and this is what it looks like. It feels really nice. Not thick at all. 
when I do this, there's none of those like thick lines or anything there that sticks. That's beautiful. And I had to tell you the truth. I haven't grabbed um, this maracuja in quite some time. They are so, so beautiful. Let me just try the other color on. But they look almost identical. Okay, so I took most of it off. I'm trying not to take the lip liner off. So I'm going to go in with this color. And I'm going to do the same exact thing. Just two clicks. And this is legit two clicks. And I think that's almost too much. So I'm going to just tap first. And I'm going to just rub my lips together. That is so freaking beautiful. So this is whichever. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Very creamy. Like I said, it's not too thick at all. It is. It does feel very balmy. It is. It does state that it's a balm. And it feels really, really nice on the lips. So these are the Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip Balms. So the next um, products that I picked up are from Hourglass. So let me just take this one off. Okay, I'm gonna, I took it completely off. I'm going to just realign my lip -aroonies. Okay, nice and neutral. And I picked up two of the Hourglass. One of them is, thank you. One of them is in mist and the other one is in slip. Let me swatch those for you. So this one is in mist. Well, this, this one kind of turns, but you know, I'm going to give you like two turns. So this one is in mist. Ooh, that's pretty. So that's mist. Look how gorgeous that is. And then this one is in slip. And the same thing, I'm gonna just do two turns. Maybe three, could be four. Okay, those are beautiful as well. Okay, so while I have um, slip in my hand, I'm gonna use a slip, I'm gonna just turn it. So this warrants about four turns. Same thing, I'm gonna just pat. I don't know if I told you that the, these are called the Hourglass Phantom Volumizing Glossy Balms. And these are 36. Okay, this is really pretty. Okay, this right off the bat feels more creamy than the tart. Like the tart felt like a balm. And this feels more like a cross between a balm and a lip oil. This feels really good. So this is the Hourglass in Slip. Mm, that's nice. Now I will tell you that they have, they have come out with like 50 million versions of like plumping, glitter, shimmer. I'm just sharing what I have. I'm not going out to buy more stuff because I have a lot and I think they all do the same thing, but I will tell you the difference and it's not thick, doesn't have any of those thick little bands. This is really pretty too. I almost want to say it's got some kind of a plumping, but it could be just like a menthol-y feel to it, but I'm not really sure. I'll leave information down below. Although I will tell you like here, like around the lips, there is a little bit of a line. I just wiped it, but the Tarte had that line there as well. So they both have that, like, it almost feels like it gathers up like right around here, but nothing earth shattering. So now I'm gonna go in with um, Slip, okay? I'm gonna just dab, because listen, girl, if you're gonna twist it up and then swipe it, it's gonna be so thick. Because these are so doggone soft, all of them. So I'm just tapping. This is so pretty. Look at this one. I know, girl, they look identical. On the hand, they really don't. But on the lips, girl, they kind of look. 
look identical. That is so pretty. Okay, so this is slip. Beautiful. Yeah, it has some kind of a, I want to say like a plumping. No, it's volumizing. It's a volumizing glossy balm. So I guess it could have some kind of a plumping effect in it. But I wouldn't say it physically looks like your lips are plump, but it's got that little bit of a feel to it. Yeah, so the first, the tarts are like balmy. These are more like, like a creamy lip oil. That's what they feel like. Okay, so those are the two high ends. It just so happens that that's the that's the sequence that I bought them. Not that I'm going to say uh, I'm going to try high end first drugstore second. That is the sequence of how I purchased them. So let me take these off. See, like it over here. Yeah, they all gather. Well, those two that I just tested, they both gather. So I'm going to just reline again. Okie dokes. And I have three of the e.l.f. I have, um, what the heck is this? I have, um, no, I take it back. I'm not going to start with the e.l.f. I'm going to start with the NYX because I got the NYX first and I got, I just picked up the e.l.f. last. So I have the NYX Fat Oil Slick Click Shiny Lip Balms. Whew, that's a mouthful. So I'm going to use this one in Going Viral. So let's try that one. Same thing. And I'm going to just click it. Twice. I'm going to put this one. So what I say this one was, this one is going viral. Oh my God, girl, you're so freaking predictable. <sighs> going viral. And then this one I picked up, um, Trending Topic. Lord. This one looks like it's got a little bit of a shimmer in it. And this click is very sturdy. Okay, this always surprises me. This is like more of like, like this purpley gloss. But if you could see it, I'm going to come close could see there's a little bit of shimmer in there. So frigate, I have this right now. Let's just try this one. And the same thing. I'm going to use it the same exact way. I'm going to just tap. It's got a little bit of a scent. Oh, this is freaking pretty. Okay. And actually, I think with these, they're a little bit thicker where you could actually swipe it. Yeah. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, wow. Yeah, not too much. Like don't, don't like click and clack all the way and swipe, but wow, this is friggin' beautiful. Mm. Okay, so this one feels, mm. I could almost, and I could be wrong, I could almost feel like the shimmer in there. Is it shimmery, right? Not really, but I don't know. Something different about this one, right? It looks so pretty. It almost feels a tiny bit gritty. Or, girl, I could have chap lips. I'm not sure. So this feels... This feels like a thicker lip balm. Like, the Tarte feels like a balm. Like a lip balm. Like a... Like a... Um, like, just like a regular balm. But this feels more thick it still feels balmy like it's not like a lip oil like the hourglass but hmm this is a beautiful beautiful winter color isn't it so nice mm. i like it interesting okay so this is the nyx fat oil slick click in trending topic I like it. Mm. Yeah, so this is balmy as well. But thicker, meaning thicker consistency. Not like thick, like it has none of that. None of that. It just feels like a thicker lip balm. And let me just open my mouth. Okay, so this one doesn't have that little like ring. Mm. Okay, I like it. It does have a shimmer to it. Yeah, I don't know if you could see that. Let me see if I could come closer to you. If you could see that, it's got a little bit of a shimmer. I think upon application, it felt a little bit gritty, but not anymore. Mmm, I like it. Okay, let's take that off, and then let's try on going viral. Okay, dokes. So I'm going to just click this one. Yeah, 
yeah, same thing. These are thicker where you can swipe. You don't have to like pat. They're still soft, but not as soft as the other two. Mm. But damn, look how shiny they are. That is pretty. Mm-hmm. So this is going viral. Okie dokes. Now, last but not least, I just picked up the e.l.f. Pout Clout Lip Pump Plumping Pen. Oof. And I got them in three colors. I got Just Peachy, Pinky Out, and Bust a Mauve. So let me just take this off. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, let me just fix my lips. Okay, let's try... Damn, who the hell... Are you, you, what the hell? I'm going to have to put my light on. Hold on one second. This one is called Pinky Out. I think it's, I think this one is Pinky Out. Who the hell could see? So this one is Pinky Out. And I'm going to just swatch it over here. I think that's Pinky Out. Looks like it. So that's Pinky Out. And then I have, um, Just Peachy. Put it over here. They are pretty though. That's just peachy. And then the last one is Bust a Mauve. Okay, so those are the three colors that I have. Okay, so while I have this one up, let's just do Bust a Mauve. Same thing, I'm gonna just tap. Okay, mm -hmm. and then I'm gonna just swipe a little bit. That's a beautiful color. Wow. It is so beautiful. It is so shiny. Wow. These are really nice. Now, let's see. These are in between the Tarte and the NYX. Like, the Tarte is very um, balmy. And then the NYX is like a thicker balm. And then the e.l.f. is probably right in between. It's not too balmy, but it's balmy enough. You know what I mean? They almost feel identical to the NYX now that I'm thinking about it. Hmm, interesting. So anyway, so nothing thick. But I will tell you, when I did the video, and of course I did like everybody else, I put too much on. And then you could see like all like those bands. But this is beautiful. Let me see if I could just build it up a little bit. And again, when you build up, just tap. You just have to tap. I mean, and then if you want, you could swipe a little bit. But I don't think you need to. They're so thick and soft. Wow, that is so beautiful, isn't it? Well, this is Elf Bust Em Off. I think I just spit. Sorry. Beautiful. This has this also has has some kind of a like plumping effect. Well, it is called plumping pen. You can you can feel it. Not that you not that they hurt, but you can feel that peppery or minty kind of feel to it. But they don't burn. All right. So let's move on to the next two colors. By the way, um, these plumping pens are eight dollars. Eight dollars. Okie dokes. So this one I think is just peachy. So let's just try this one. And again, I'm just going to tap first. That's pretty. And then I'm going to swipe a little bit. That's beautiful. This is, this one for some reason feels more creamy than bust them off. Hold it. Yeah, you cannot swipe with this one because I just did a little bit aggressively and it was too much over there. This is beautiful. Wow. Yep, definitely um, minty. That's for sure. I mean, you, there's really not much of those bands.
maybe like right over here and see this these these lighter colors they do create like that ring see that let me see if i could I, I, you could blend them in i'm wondering if like you blend them in do they keep on coming back and do and does it do that because you have too much product on so let's blend them in Let's chit chat for a little bit. Hey, how you doing? How's the kids? How's the dog? How's the cat? Blah, blah, blah. And we're yippity yapping and we're chit chatting and what's going on? Uh, no, I mean a little bit. But this is a beautiful, look how pretty that color is, right? Anyway, so this is Elf Just Peachy. So pretty. This would be like a beautiful color in the summertime with a nice tan. Ooh, I love it. I love, love, love. Okay, so last color. Perfect. And then the last color is Pinky Out. Yeah, for some reason, um, the Just Peachy and the Pinky Out feel a lot creamier and bust them all that's interesting this one's beautiful you have to pat don't swipe mm -mm. you're gonna make a mess mm, they are so creamy so this is the elf pinky out that's beautiful same thing, just a little bit over here that those bands. And yes, got that ring. I just blend that out. They are freaking beautiful and shiny. That is so freaking pretty. What I want to do, because the comparison to me feels a lot like um, the maracuja. I want to go back and put the tart maracuja on one more time. Let me just take a feel. Okay, so this is really balmy. You can tell the difference from uh, the Elf and the NYX. The NYX is a thick balm where these are more... I'm not really sure. It doesn't matter about the color. I just want to go back in with the tart, which I wish I knew the color, but I don't. Yeah, you know, the tarts are creamier. Where the NYX and the ELF are more balmy, if that makes any kind of sense. And the Hourglass is legit. You could feel that it's more luxurious, but not for $36 in my opinion. I mean, the Hourglass is more like a hybrid between a balm and a lip oil. It's really, really nice, but is it worth like that big of a difference The $36 compared to $8 or 11? I personally don't think so, but some people may. So, hmm. so in conclusion, I'm gonna just grab one of each. So in conclusion, the Tarte, the Hourglass, the NYX and the ELF. So let's just compare the Tart, and like I said, this is the original one. The tart is um, a beautiful, creamy balm. Very, very creamy, which is $24. Then the Hourglass is legit, in my opinion, it feels like a hybrid between a balm and a lip oil. Very, very beautiful, very nourishing. These are $36. The NYX is a legit balm. It's beautiful and it's shiny, $11. And then the e.l.f., which to me feels not as, and I don't mean thick like it's on, it goes on thick. Like the NYX, the formula feels thicker. Not that it goes on thick, if that makes any sense. The formula feels thicker, whereas the e.l.f., the formula feels softer, it, like upon, upon application. But when it's on the lips, it feels very, very close to the NYX. And this is $8. So listen, totally up to you guys. I think they're all great. Um, 
If you guys like high-end, go get the high-end. If you guys don't like high-end and you want to do drugstore, the NYX and the e.l.f. are just as beautiful. I mean, they, they're all beautiful. It really, like to me personally, it's really just a personal preference of um, what, what you want to spend and what you're interested in. But they're all great, great products. They all do the same thing. Clicky clack, click clack. You cannot swipe. Although the NYX, you could swipe a little bit. You cannot swipe. You really, really have to patty pat pat and like just dab a little bit. I think the lighter colors have a tendency to create that uh, ring, whereas the dark ones really didn't. Or not that I noticed it. But anyway, so that's what I think. But they are all beautiful. So anyway, that is it. That is my video on comparing um, all these clickety-clack pens. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave me some comments below. Do you guys have any of these products? Which ones do you like? Which ones are worth it? Which ones aren't? Anyway, leave everything down below. I'd love, love, love to chit chat with you guys. So that is it, guys. This is my video. Thank you so, so much for sharing your time with me. And as always, you guys, be good to each other, love each other, and have a great, great day. Bye.